Hello, people of YouTube. I am Triforce Wisdom 64, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X. Boomer Quanger! We got his weakness, homing torpedo, in the last episode from Launch Octopus. We're going to take him down. Ah, got hit. That's basically the strategy for taking those guys down with Storm Tornado. This part you just kind of want to run through. Those hard to see lasers, if they're there and you run through them, those invincible robots will shoot at you. They barely do any damage though, so if you got that power up that is necessary, that halves the damage you take, they're not threatening at all. And you can just run through that part only taking like three hits. Here we have a segment with these spikes, you can jump on top of them, but of course if you hit them from beneath, you will die. These enemies come out of nowhere and can hit you into the spikes, but if you're invincible, the spikes will not kill you, and you'll go through the platform and god darn it! Ugh. Also, don't even bother trying to shoot them. This is actually the second time I'm recording this episode, because as with the first part of my Knights of the Old Republic playthrough, I ran out of time. Turns out my videos uh, have a maximum of four minute, uh, 14 minutes rather, and 59 seconds, uh, not 15 minutes. It was exactly 15 minutes long, and it said, this video is too long, do you want to make it shorter? I don't even understand that. There's no time limit on YouTube. Why does the freaking camera on the iPod have a 14.59 limit? Also, I hit stop when it was at 14.59. It rounded up to 15. Seriously. I got cheated. So yeah, this part, you want to be able to dash quickly, so you want to use A. Uh, you don't want to be charging a shot and double tapping. No reason to charge shots in this part anyways. Come out here, and we have these platforms jutting out with turrets on them. We can wall jump onto the platforms and then destroy the turrets. Got these ladders with monkeys on them. We can just shoot the monkeys. This is a cool little vertical segment. Little. It's like a third of the level. And I called it little. It's a kind of big vertical segment. <laughs> Being a retro game, it can get kind of dangerously laggy if there's a lot going on. That heart tank we can't get yet. These guys, these turrets on these platforms, can only shoot upwards and sideways, so they're not really a threat. So yeah, I'm trying to rush through this. I did this stage, and then I did Stink Chameleon, because Boomer Quanger's weapon is Stink Chameleon's weakness. That part you can just kind of go up, and now let's go to Boomer Quanger. A 
I'm doing like two minutes better than I did in my first try of recording. Boomer Quanger has the shortest invincibility period of any Maverick. That right there was the special attack you get for beating him, Boomerang Cutter. And there you go, shortest invincibility period of any Maverick. We beat him in less than 30 seconds. Now to take on Stink Chameleon with Boomerang Cutter. You get Boomerang Cutter. And they loop back to you. If you shoot like four at a time and the first one kills an enemy, or if any of them kill an enemy, all the other ones will come back to you and your weapon energy will replenish for them and they will not actually cost weapon energy. And as usual, each of them are as powerful as a green buster shot on standard enemies. So you can kind of spam it. It's a really spammable Maverick power. I already got the Dr. Light Capsule in the stage, so I'm going to go through it kind of fast. There is something else for me to get, however. Alright, here, if you defeated Launch Octopus, there's water here. Normally, there would not be. And also, if you got, in Storm Eagle stage, the uh, headbutt, you can break those. And then you can dash jump, and with the higher water level, you can get the heart tank. And the rocks fall. And then we die. I don't, I don't know if you can actually make it back. You probably can, though. I failed. I failed in my last attempt, too. Whatever. We're not gonna let it bother us. We're just gonna take out Stink Chameleon. The rocks, if they land directly on our head because we got that headbutt, uh, they will just break and not hurt us. However, if they hit us in the front or the back, they will hurt us. And these guys, of course, are enemies, so they will still hurt us. Like, really? Why do those rocks hurt us? They would... Oh, come on! Ah. Uh, what? Really? Last time I died in the same place I did in Boomer Quanger stage, but I also got two free guys going into Stink Chameleon stage. So I died getting the heart tank, but I still made it to the end. This time I game over because I didn't get the free guys and I died one more time than I did last time. That sucks. I wish I had my last recording. But again, 15 minutes exactly is too much apparently. 14.59. And if it's above that, it rounds up. If it reaches 1459, I think it's whatever it reaches, it rounds up by one for no reason at all. We still have the heart tank, because thankfully that does save. Well, it doesn't save, but it's in the password. The passwords are, however, about to get jerkish as soon as I finish getting my collectible. which I will do after beating this stage. Oh, come on! I should have been able to grab that. I'm not back at the beginning, am I? Really? So much for having better time than in my last recording. I don't care about you. I don't 
care that I'm getting hit. I'll get health in the uh, ride armor section of this level. Free man there. Ride armor. Mud that you go a lot faster on top of than down in, and you can jump like to get higher in it. Health. Get out. Boomerang cutter. Boomerang clanger, in case you couldn't tell, is essentially Cut Man from Jump and Shoot Man, aka Mega Man 1. Alright, Stink Chameleon, I'm gonna take you down. Oh. If you use that while you're like in the air coming down, he will shoot it downwards. I think if you use it while you're going up, he will actually shoot it, like, still upwards, which he does when you're just standing still on the ground. So it would appear. And as I said, you can kind of spam it. Because if you hit him and he's in... Oh, no, you can't. Pardon me. thought during my last fight that they were coming back. Like, I fought him in the last uh, time I tried to record this. I do more damage than you do, because I got your armor. And now that we've beaten all eight Mavericks, and, well, first we have to get his weapon. We get Chameleon Sting. That makes a whole lot of sense. Sting Chameleon, you had Chameleon Sting, get it? Now we get a cutscene. Finally, we found Sigma's fortress. Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans. And there's Sigma. In the next part, we will get the four, three, the three remaining power-ups that I need to get. See you guys, and then, yeah, see you guys next time. That's probably all we're gonna do.